Hi, it's Jennifer with Jennifer at Home. I'm so glad you're here today because today I'm going to reveal the dress I chose for my daughter's upcoming wedding. In my previous video, I asked for help. I tried on all the mother of the bride dresses that I had ordered and I needed help selecting the right one. Well, my husband came home from work and I tried them all on again and between his help and the help of a couple of friends and from all of your suggestions, which I greatly appreciate, we were able to select a dress. I really, really appreciate all of your wonderful comments and all of the nice suggestions and things that you, all, every comment that you gave me, I greatly appreciate and I'm so thankful for all of you. I appreciate it so much. But in the end, this is the dress I chose. You may not like this one, but after some deep thought, and I realized after all that this particular dress didn't need hemmed after all. It really wasn't as long as I thought it was. And I really liked the pearl detailing. Everyone that commented on the silver one, that was my number one choice for a while. However, the very thin jacket, I was so afraid that I would snag the fabric. It was very thin and it's the type of fabric that if you are not careful, it'll snag easily. And I really started to worry and I was very concerned that if I accidentally snagged that silver jacket that it would be very noticeable and it would ruin the whole uh, the whole dress. I wouldn't be able to wear the jacket with it and I didn't want a sleeveless dress. So in the end I decided to go with a, ja a dress without a jacket. Still had the pearl neck trim and I really wanted champagne. I really wanted a champagne color dress. So in the end, my husband, this was his favorite, and I thought it was very comfortable, and I was very happy to go with the one that he really liked the most. Let me show you. Here's the one I chose. This is a dress by Maya Brooke, and it has the three-quarter sleeves, the pearl trim on the neckline, and it's I just really like the color. So I put it back on, and I wore it around the house a little bit, and I decided that I was very, very comfortable in it. So this was the ultimate choice, and I thank you so much. All of you had great ideas and suggestions. I appreciate it so much, and thank you supporting for supporting me on my YouTube channel and on this journey, and also with all of the videos I had and the nice comments you leave. I appreciate all of you very much, and I'll have the wedding video coming out here in just a couple of weeks, and I hope that you'll join me then. Thank you so much to those of you who have subscribed. And if you haven't subscribed, I would love for you to do so. I would appreciate it so much. And then we can meet back here two to three times a week for videos and catching up with each other. I love hearing from all of you. And I would love for everyone to like, share, and subscribe if you haven't already.